Hey, so my name is Yoshi Shiraki, and I wanted to share a little bit about myself to help you kind of get to know who I am. Um, you know, right after high school, believe it or not, I actually went and studied a completely different industry. I actually went and learned how to cut hair for a living. Uh, I moved from Salt Lake City, where I went to high school, and moved out to um, London, England, where I uh, studied the craft of hair, and then moved to New York City for, uh, I lived in London for a year, and then moved to New York for about 18 years where I became a stylist to uh, the stars. I was actually Anderson Cooper's personal hairstylist for over six years and cut people like Matthew Broderick and Joan Osborne. And, and um, when I decided to move back to Salt Lake City, and I should actually say with my wife, I, I met my wife out in New York City. She's born and raised out there. And um, while we dated, we would come visit my family here in Salt Lake to go skiing in the winter and, and uh, kind of hiking in the summer and my wife fell in love with Salt Lake City, Utah. And so I should say, my wife was the one who um, decided that she wanted to move to Utah. So when my wife decided that it was time to move to Utah and we came out here, I obviously lost my whole entire clientele of uh, hair clients. And so I had to either one, build a new clientele, which was kind of starting all over from scratch, or just start all over, literally with a new industry, with a new career, which is how I decided to follow, um, follow my um, desire to try real estate. And so, um, basically, I now do real estate full-time here in Salt Lake City. I have for about the last eight, nine, 10 years. Wow, um, time flies. Um, and, um, you know, I've also published a book that educates children on the prevention of sexual abuse. It's called My Body's Just For Me. Uh, you can check it out. Um, you can go to protectourangels.com. Um, but I'm also passionate about the prevention of child abuse and became a volunteer on the board of the Salt Lake Children's Justice Center. Uh, if you don't know what that is, the Children's Justice Center is a place where kids can go basically get justice um, when uh, they've been a victim of abuse. The Salt Lake County Children's Justice Center um, works with doctors uh, that, that will treat the child if uh, they have physical abuse as well as law enforcement and so that being uh, important to me I sit on the board of the Salt Lake County Children's Justice Center um, and I've also invented a dog leash. You know living out in New York City Everybody walks their dog everywhere because nobody has a yard, right? We don't get to let our dog out in the backyard. So if you're going to go to the post office, you're going to run to get a, uh, you know, a lunch or go to the bank, you usually take your dog with you so the dog can get exercise. And when you get to different locations, some people, some, some locations don't let dogs inside. And so everybody's tying their dog outside to a tree, a parking meter, a light post. And um, due to that, I came up with the concept of a new invention for a dog leash and you can check that out at snap leash like snap your fingers snapleash.com um, but anyways I'm kind of a free spirit entrepreneur I like to do a lot of things I'm obviously married I've got two kids now a two-year-old son and a 12 week um, 12 year 13 14 week uh, your old daughter and uh, again wow time flies it just goes by so quickly but um, you know I love real estate I love being an entrepreneur I love volunteering I love helping where I can I love helping the community where I can and um, and I love obviously hanging out I think my favorite thing in the world is to hang out with my two kids and my wife um, right now it's been such a fun exciting time uh, as our two-year-old is now trying everything for the first time, which is so much fun. Uh, but I um, wanted to share a little bit about myself, and um, thanks for watching.